，第十三页，文艺选填，抢救青少年听力大作战。How to protect kids' hearing? Nowadays, when it comes to protecting young people from unnecessary harm, considerable attention is being paid to limiting their screen time. Cutting back on screen time is undoubtedly important for their physical and mental well-being. Nonetheless, many experts believe that insufficient attention is given to protecting their hearing. The World Health Organization (WHO) has reported that millions of young people are frequently exposed to harmful levels of sound. Additionally, the WHO has asserted. That the lengths of time young people spend listening to loud sounds, often through headphones, can be hazardous to their health. Moreover, it is not just headphones that pose a problem. Young people also frequently encounter dangerously loud sounds at concerts, sporting events, or other recreation venues. Exposure to loud sounds can have a damaging effect on people's hearing. But there are also other negative outcomes, such as impaired academic performance and mental health problems. So, what can be done to protect a person's ears? Headphones appear to be one of the main culprits of impaired hearing in young people. Regarding this, there are a number of measures that can be adopted to ensure one is using headphones safely. First, if others can hear sound from your headphones, they are turned up too loud. Second, consider purchasing noise-canceling headphones. Although expensive, these headphones can block out background noise. Therefore, you should be able to hear what you are listening to clearly at a low volume. Finally, it is a good idea to get your hearing tested at least once every three years. Remember that taking precautions to protect your hearing will help you grow up healthy and happy. That is well worth the investment of some time and money.